I didn't do it. I didn't. I didn't do it. Okay. You know what? Maybe I did do it. Who knows? What's going on everybody? Jared here with another psychological thriller of a movie review. Now, if you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button because it seriously helps me out and it keeps you guys up to date on this channel's newest content every single week. Movie reviews, trailer reactions, everything in that realm. So there was this movie that was on my calendar for August that I never got to see. Finally found out that it was at the local art house film, went over and checked it out and it's called Loose. A liberal-minded couple are forced to reconsider their image of their adopted son after they discover he has written an extremely disturbing essay for his class at school. So is Loose one that keeps you guessing till the end? Let's find out. But before I get into my thoughts, let me know what you guys thought of this stereotypical thriller psychological business in this film in the comments down below. Now let's get into some of the good. Hopefully I don't get too excited talking about Loose throughout this review, but I am so, so, so happy that I was able to go check out this movie because it was, again, one that I, it kind of slipped through the cracks and a lot of people had recommended it and I went out and man, the story, the plot, everything in this, I love a good mystery and this movie from beginning to end has you guessing, there's mystery elements, but the reason the mystery was so enthralling was because of the point of view that Luce took in this story. Obviously, there's Luce, there's his teacher, there's the uh, principal, and then his parents, but it follows the point of view of his parents, so they only know certain parts of the story of what's going on, and believe me, there's things that appear as though they're not, you know, you don't believe this person, you might believe this person, the facts are there, but you don't entirely believe them. And as the story continues, another piece of the puzzle falls into place, and this person that you think was this maybe good-hearted person turns out to be maybe more on the sinister side of things, and that's another aspect of the movie that, oh my gosh, when people are talking and it's that, you know, that conversation where you're talking to someone and they know that you know, but they don't want you to know that they know that's this movie and it's tension it's this almost chilling aspect of these people sparring in conversations with them knowing that they don't know and I mean I loved it it's it's hard to explain but I love that aspect I guess another reason was the themes or the perception of how certain certain things in loose play out obviously it's leaning into stereotypical and cultural aspects dealing with the main character his family the teacher everyone even some classmates and that was one thing that honestly made me even more invested but also to think about myself because of the world and how it's set up right now like if someone of color is does something that's maybe not completely correct they're gonna take someone else's word over them and that's what is is I guess present in this movie. Moving from the intrigue of the story, Loose would not have been as I guess interesting or enthralling if it wasn't for the performances. Obviously the parents, the principal, they give in they give decent performances, but Octavia Spencer again, she turns in a phenomenal performance here as the kind of counter to the loose character as the teacher you know standing up for uh civil rights she's this civil rights uh, activist i guess and she's really strong in her own opinions and for her race but she's determined she's frightening and again going back to how i mentioned the sparring conversations between characters her conversations amongst or with loose are some of the best in this movie which brings me to the loose character and kelvin harris jr's performance my god, maybe it was just me. Wait, someone flushed the toilet. Maybe it's a little premature or it's just me, but this was by far the best performance I've seen from any actor, actress in 2019 so far. He is smart, he is frightening, he's calculated, he's articulate. And the thing is, he is one step ahead of everyone in this movie. And from one scene, in a matter of seconds, this character goes from laughing to a straight look, to instantly crying. I mean, right there, hitting almost every spectrum of feeling or emotion. This guy, this Harrison character, Harrison actor, I, I don't know what else he's been in, but my God, he is phenomenal. And the bad thing is, I, I hope, I hope that he gets some sort of awards notice at the end of the year, at, at least nominated. Because again, this was a phenomenal performance. And if it wasn't for his character, this movie would just would not have been as good or I guess 
enjoyable for myself. And one final thing, I always skip over it and people get mad, but the score in movies and the score in Loose is a character itself. It's frightening, it's chilling, it's haunting, and every time it kicks in, I am 100% like the character or person on screen it doesn't appear like it's supposed to be and something is gonna flip, the script is gonna flip and you're gonna be in for this ride. I absolutely adored Loose, you know, it kept me going, kept me guessing, you know, the characters, the performances were very good, but probably the one little tiny thing, the little negative, it's not that big a deal, was the structure of the story or the plot and how the movie played out. It might be a little bit confusing. I mean, you have to be invested in this movie because there's maybe a little scene here that is gonna play into the end or vice versa and just the conversations that these people have. So maybe the structuring, but I thoroughly enjoyed it. Overall, Loose is this mystery thriller that will keep you engaged and guessing till the end. With tones of uneasiness, playing with perceptions, some phenomenal performances and a haunting score, but with some plot points not landing for everyone, I would highly recommend checking out Loose. Again, this is a smaller indie art house film. It is honestly one of my top movies of probably 2019, and it would it, Harrison's performance is phenomenal. In closing, I'm gonna give Loose 4.5 out of 5 perfect students. So what did you guys think of Loose? I wanna know in the comments down below. Anyways guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. Watch some more videos up there, you know, movie reviews, trailer reactions, fun comedy skits, you know, there's brand new stuff on my channel almost every day, every other day, so stay tuned for all of that. Check it out, follow all of my social media stuff down there. Just click that subscribe button, it seriously helps me out. I'm almost at 2,000, and until next time, I'll see you later.